A judge ordering the killer nurse Janine Jones undergo mental evaluations. She's already serving a life sentence for killing a Kerrville infant in 1984 and is now awaiting trial in the 1981 death of another baby here in San Antonio. Our Paul Venema in court as Jones' lawyer explains why he asked for the testing. Jones, who is confined to a wheelchair, said nothing during the hearing, and she spoke only briefly with her lawyer before he asked for a mental evaluation. We think that we should be entitled to, to both a uh, competency exam and a uh, family. Cox was appointed to defend Jones last year in her murder trial. She's accused of injecting 11-month-old Joshua Sawyer with a lethal drug dose in 1981 while he was a patient and she was a nurse in a San Antonio hospital. I feel that she may be indeed uh, be incompetent to, 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 to stand trial. He explained that preparing her defense has become a challenge. My ability to have meaningful and detailed conversations with her with reference to uh, uh, alleged uh, events that occurred uh, more than 30 years ago had been diminished. Prosecutors did not oppose Jones' request. I will grant a request for both competency and sanity evaluations. We don't know how long Jones' evaluation will take. Her trial date is set for July, but that in all likelihood will change depending on the length and the outcome of the evaluation. Paul Venema, KSAT 12 News.